Welcome to Hesham Nature Reserve. We would like to lead you around the reserve on a mini beast hunt. All you will need is our guide, a tick sheet, and of course a pencil. First, let us learn a little bit more about our amazing insects. We live in an exciting world, one that is teeming with wildlife. These creatures surround our everyday lives, and it is up to you, the young naturalist, to go out and explore these wonders of nature. Important in maintaining the balance of our natural world, these mini beasts pollinate our flowers and crops, which is essential for growth of plants in the wild and the food we eat. They also nourish and aerate our soils or there to provide food for other wildlife such as toads or frogs and are vital in keeping our ecosystem going. You would be amazed to know there are currently millions of species of insects in the world and over 40,000 of these live in the UK. These come in lots of different shapes and sizes. From bees, butterflies and beetles to spiders, snails and slugs and even though some might seem unimportant. Don't be fooled by either their size or their colour. Being small helps them blend well into their environment and as they work hard to maintain the balance to keep us safe are totally worth our protection. Let us go out and explore to see what we can find by following our friend here, the red-tailed bumblebee. Why don't you have a go in your garden at home? You could even create your own mini beast tick sheet and see how many legs your bugs have. Locate a log, stone or area of grass and explore. Here we have ants transporting their eggs. Ants have six legs. These woodlouse have more than six legs. Our beetle here has six legs. This millipede has more than six legs. This spider found hiding under some slate it has more than six legs. And our wiggly worm has no legs. This snail moving slowly along the stone has no legs. And our slug, no legs. Bumblebees have six legs. Here, our common blue butterfly. She's a female butterfly and has six legs. Here, our hoverfly on an oxeye daisy also has six legs. This burnet companion moth has six legs. And our grasshopper, whoops, six slippery legs. Our common blue damselfly, enjoying a good meal, has six legs. And our wasp also has six legs. Please note, it is always important to take care when searching for insects by moving slowly and carefully and making sure you place back any stones or logs you have lifted. Also, please take note of what insects you find and avoid handling them if at all possible. And always wash your hands after. Make sure you have recorded all of your sightings. Click the link below if you'd like to download the worksheets and crafts relating to insects. If you would like to see more films, please click subscribe now. Hope to see you soon.